not just about a place where the food purchase happens. You know, you feel like you're a part of something. It's definitely a store that is invested in its community. And the connections with places like the Intervale. You go to the produce section and there's a face behind that tag. The health that we have in Burlington is directly related to places like this. You, know, you feel like you're supporting them and they're supporting you with all these great food. And it grows a community and we grow it. it it's symbiotic. The other thing that hasn't changed is a commitment to wholesome food, supporting local agriculture, supporting organic food products and organic producers of food, and trying to make sure that those who produce food earn a livable wage has always been a priority for the co-op. You produce it, we'll buy it, and it's basically what we say to the farmers. So. You know, having a place in between there that's called City Market is one of the best, you know, places you could have in between farmer and customer if you've got to have something between farmers and customers. Last year, local purchases um, were about 33% of our product, about $11 million. We have on any given day as many as 2,400 local products. My job is, as much as it's about growing vegetables, it's about making relationships and developing those relationships. You know, if we're going to have a local agricultural economy in Vermont, we need fantastic uh, stores uh, like City Market that is going to sell the farmer products. There's that whole aspect of dollars that are spent in the community that stay in the community have a multiplier effect. The money stays here, the money gets spent here. We've had the patronage refund program where we take our member purchases and we're able to refund back to our members. At the end of the year you get a dividend check for how much money you spend at City Market, which is awesome. Over the past five and a half years, we, we all sent back $2.7 million back into the community as a way of saying thank you to members for what they purchased. At the end of the year, I get a check for doing what I would do anyway. It's a co-op. The money stays right here in the community. We do have a, a Food for All program, which is a membership uh, that we created so that if somebody either participates in the food stamps, WIC, or Social Security Disability, uh, they can come in and get a 10% discount. When we were on WIC, we got a WIC discount, which was wonderful. The Food for All program helped my family when my son was first born, made it very affordable. That group of members has grown into over a thousand people who have joined and last year the food for all purchases were a million nine. Participating in that kind of collective action of, of creating an entity that serves the whole community by becoming a member. You've got the great food, you've got great community, you've got a lot of jobs created, there's a lot of great things that's happening kind of within the store walls but I think for us you know the more important parts are really what's happening outside of the walls. It's an essential part of the community. It's just really powerful feeling for me to a sense of belonging, being part of something that's bigger than myself. I'm amazed at just how deeply co-op staff go out of their way to support the local food economy and really build local businesses. As the director of the Intervale Center, obviously we have a lot of strong partnerships with City Market. Do you want to eat it? Well, we're volunteering at Somervale right now. They really like to encourage people to work in the community if they can. Do some member worker hours for cool organizations like Grow Team One. I do my membership hours at the Sustainability Academy. They're huge supporters of Somervale. <laughs> and everybody loves Somervale. City Market promotes community outreach by having member work hours with their community partners, so Intervale's one of them. Right. And it's, it's been great. Fun. We get to meet a lot of people in the Burlington area. Food programs that educate people about nutrition. They've been very active in my son's school um, and have given donations of food and other supports. Co-op members have supported our work strengthening the local food system. Giving some tangible benefit to various nonprofits and educational organizations. I think it is very impressive as well what uh, the co-op has done to um, serve the entire community. If we're going to survive on this planet, we have to develop community. It's been a community all along. Happy 40th and forever young. Happy anniversary to the co-op. Happy 40th anniversary. Uh, here's to the first 40 and at least another 40 uh, for the next 40 years. If I'm lucky, I'll be here for the 41st. Happy birthday. We are so <laughs> obsessed with you. Glad you're here. We really love you.